The Museum of London Docklands is able to bring together for the very first time Christina Broom's life story and photography. Christina is widely regarded as a pioneering female press photographer for the UK and so it's now that really we can start to appreciate what Christina was achieving and really taking notice of the subject matter which she managed to secure from you know the historic moments with suffragettes through to say the king lying in state or the royal coronation. The royal family photos I think are um quite unique that she's got very good access. Today, photographing the royals, even if you do have that access of a one-on-one -on -one portrait with them, it's still very controlled. You're kept a bit of a distance apart nowadays, but it looks like that she was a groundbreaker as regards to photographers with people of that privileged uh, circle. For women who were so much more used to being in the studio as photographers, she really pushed her way out into the crowds and secured wonderful topical images. She must have been a very strong and a very courageous woman. It's not easy to walk into a world which is dominated by, by men um, and make a difference. A lot of her pictures recall the soldiers off to fight the war. It's made a lot of the younger generations appreciate what was happening a hundred years ago. My favourite photo in the exhibition is of the troops going off to war when they're standing at the station platform um, and you can see the emotion of having to say goodbye to a loved one when you don't know if you're going to see them again. You know, it highlights the fact that as press photographers we don't just photograph an event as a temporary consumption but as something that is a historical document. She recorded an, an amazing catalogue of, of a very special time in the history of this country. And to see these photographs a hundred years on makes you wonder that a simple job that we might cover today will be something that somebody will be talking about in a hundred years time.